first, I would like to give you the main idea of each theory. First, utilitarian theory. The main idea is ethically right means the action result is a greater number of utilities than could be achieved by any other action. Next, egoism theory. A main idea which is a person must perform in his or her own interest. An action is considered to be ethically right only when it promotes a person's self-interest. Third, deontology theory. The main idea it underlines the duty as a base of moral category which can be seen as a right or wrong judgment. It does not look at the consequences of action and there's a universal ethical uh, action that everyone must accept. Fourth, uh, virtue ethic theory. The main idea is uh, this theory uh, focus on what makes good individual or person rather than what makes a good action. So there are specific virtue traits that every person must have. A summary of ethical theories. First, consequences theories that consists of utilitarian theory and egoism theory. Consequences theories mean that the right action is the one that produces the most benefit. And the utilitarian theories mean greatest good for greatest. While the egoism theories mean is focus on yourself. Go to the next one is deontology theories, which is come from Kant's theories that is duty is the basic moral category and that is independence of consequences. Both of these come from action and the meaning of this, what kind of action should we perform. Next, virtue ethics. Virtue are ethics are coming from Aristotle theory and this is basis from character and what kind of person should we be. Meanwhile, divine commentary is a religion and following religion, belief and principle. Next one is relativism theory. This coming from culture and the meaning is morally right is specific, society accept it. So that's all for today. Thank you everyone.